Hey, it's Monday, and I wanted to give you a quick look at what my son and I call repurposing. Yes, it's been our challenge this year to see how many different ways we can repurpose our new Christmas tree and get it all the way through the year. So you know what this weekend is? Yes sir, it's Easter weekend and we have us an Easter bunny Christmas tree. Look at this. Okay, look at what we have here. There's the Easter bunny He's in the tree. Look at those Easter eggs. The glittery ones. We got, yeah, Volkswagens and Easter bunnies. If we keep going, look at that glittery Easter bunny egg. Look at this Volkswagen and the Easter Bunny colors. There's another look. He's just hanging out in the tree. Early this year, it was actually just a few weeks ago, we decorated this tree. Not more than a few weeks ago as a St. Patrick's Day tree. That wasn't too tough. We just kept the lights off and just kept it green. <laughs> Them Irish, <laughs> that holiday kind of made it easy for us. So here's our Easter bunny tree with Easter eggs. And we're here with our buddy. Who is this? I believe that's our buddy Cutworm. Hey Cutworm, look we got you next to the Easter Bunny tree. Let me back up here so we can have Cutworm in. Look at that. We have Cutworm in with the Easter Bunny tree. Now if that don't get you in the hopping spirit, I don't know what will. So Steve like those sheets it, it's like i thought at first you decorated them trees like we did our tree and you know they were easter bunny trees with sheets to keep the bunnies warm so let's turn this around my friend there you go there is an Easter bunny tree, buddy. Next holiday, we'll have to see what we can do. That's it from the bus man and our buddy who's standing by on my TV, Mr. Cutworm. We'll see you next time. Bye. Say bye, Steve. Steve. Come on, Steve. Say bye. Bye, y'all.